Hey, 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 we're shooting some video of a Malawan and a German Shepherd working together. Young Nicky there has never worked with Casper before. He's the fill-in role model to set the tone of what she needs to be doing in this situation. So if she's going to be around other dogs and work with other dogs, she's got to get used to it. So that's what this little video is about to show. And she's great with other dogs. It's just she needs to work in tandem with other dogs, and that takes practice. So Casper is older, he's more mature, he's used to taking the inside role. When you're working with two dogs together, a lot of times you just have to fuss around to decide which dog wants to be the lead dog. Sometimes one is predominantly the inside dog and the other one's not. But the point here is Nikki, the young Malinois female, can work in tandem with a more um, adult mature dog and holds her own nicely. She heals nicely, nice automatic sit. When uh, Nick asks him to jump, no problems with the jumping. See, her obedience is signal faded enough that we don't need big hand signals. So practicing this on leash, make sure that when we do it off leash, it's good. But as you can see clearly, we're not using the leash for signals just controlling the outcome here and that's the key to good dog training is make sure that when you do something that the outcome is what you want it to be not what the dog decides it's going to be so all kinds of fun stuff with her she's a fun dog good attitude growing up maturing um, once again doesn't know this dog and still willing to get in here and hang out with him and work with him doesn't know these dogs but they're not a distraction so just a little additional video of young Nikki in action. Good stuff.